hello and welcome back to Outer Worlds. We're heading to pick up some supplies uh, for Amber Heights uh, that I'm kind of hoping to overthrow eventually, but first they probably shouldn't die. I'm not sure if we're gonna use fast travel or not. It just it can just save us a lot of time, so we might do it. Frankly, I I think I'm just gonna do it. So, it's not gonna be the, the true supernova experience here. I don't know, I just feel like the fast travel could save us a lot of time and uh, that's gonna be just fine. The game is still more difficult. In many ways. But this doesn't really add difficulty. Or, well, you can, you can argue that it adds immersion. But we can already fast travel to the ship. And I already cleaned up this place, uh, like, half an hour ago. Hey, Nels. Excuse me, but this area's off limits. We got a leaky generator. It ain't safe. It's safe for you? That's my nice way of telling you to saw it off. What's going on here? We're fixing a leaky generator. <laughs> What's it to you? <laughs> That's a good answer. <clears throat> What's wrong with the generator? What are you, a safety inspector? It's busted. Pumping out gas. It ain't safe. Can I look at it? So you're just standing around this fence, though? Shouldn't you be fixing it? Oh, whoops. I'll get right on that, boss. Hope this ain't in my performance review. I need to get inside. And I'm just gonna let you walk on in? Why is that now? I can fix leaky generators. Intimidate 100. If you don't, I'll go through you. Is this job worth dying over? <clears throat> You're here for Carlotta. I get it. I'll off her. You get paid. We'll go. We all go home with a win. Wow. Bribe 2,400. I'm here to investigate reports of mantis swarm infestation. Oh, of all the void damned. I ain't getting eaten alive for a couple of bits. Pack it up, crew! Ooh. They're going away. Look at that. Sublight tug. They're all going away with big guns. Fine. It's too quiet. What are you up to out there? What? Hello? 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 Uh, the sublight squad is gone. <clears throat> Do you have a moon to talk about our Lord and Jesus? <laughs> Do you have a moon to talk about our salvation through the order of scientific inquiry? You can't be serious. Who are you anyway? Um, just a family neighborhood iconoclast. It doesn't matter who I am. I'm here to pick up Graham's supplies. Oh shit. Isn't this uh, Max? The car Max? Not Max. Is it Max? I don't know. This is the Vicar's specialty? I'm light. Graham sent me to collect supplies. Awesome. Finally. Tell Graham that this is the last run I'm doing. Sanjar has declared a stop sale to you lot, but even if he hadn't, I'm not risking my neck anymore. Hey there, Carlotta. I was actually looking for you quite a bit. Don't I have a lot of things? That, uh, oh no, Catherine, never mind that. I don't know how you got those goons to leave, but thank you. Graham ordered rollers and what's-its, right? For a printing press? Here, take them. Like I said, this is my last run. Why did Sanjar ban you from working with the iconoclasts? You'd have to ask him. All I know is that if I get caught, I'll get arrested. It's not great. Maybe Sanjar is not that great. Why why have you been helping Graham? It's an enviable thing he's doing. Free people and all that. I can't live that way. I need my structure. But I respect the iconoclasts for doing it. Uh, where will they get their supplies now? Law help them. 
I don't know. Maybe Sublight can lend a hand. I doubt I it. I should go. Look, Graham's got a bit or two left in his account. I can send one last dropout before I wash my hands of this. What do you want delivered? Graham's looking for high capacity data cartridges. Uh, Zora suggested extra food and medicine. Yeah, we're not dealing with that shit. I always took that woman for the sensible type. Good on her. I'll send some along. Give them all my regards. And good luck out there. Don't go getting eaten. No promises. <clears throat> oh, bye now. Maybe not. Like, I guess we're gonna pick it. Plasma launcher. Good stuff. Plasma carbine. Yeah, why not? Tossable card, Brandon Rosser. Okay, we can just sell that. Uh, sure. Ah, uh, whatever, we may sell that. Drino, bit cartridge, necklace. And that's it. Return to Graham. Ah, uh, let's do that, with fast travel. That's gonna save us some time. You all Graham, got I got your stuff! Ain't that neat? You come to Monarch and that's what you're excited about. You ought to get out more. I'm getting out right now. <laughs> yeah, probably should visit Hayes Grave with Nyoka. Find Sweetheart Cakes on Monarch. Old Rizzo's facility. Track down Reginald Cheney. I'm not sure where this is. It's uh, farther away. Ah, uh, yeah, we we're returning to Graham. I'm telling you, the Van Noys are fine. Bullshit, Graham. They don't just abandon orders, and they weren't at the ruins. Where in this sulfur sodden hellhole did you send them? They're on a very important... Ah, we'll continue this later. Welcome back, Captain. I got your rollers. The rest of your account went to food and medicine. Where the van noise? They're hunters. Badass ones at that. Hope they're alright. They're our best unit, and now they're missing in action. And we'll continue that discussion later. I got your rollers. The rest of your account went to food and medicine. Thank the Eternal that someone's got some sense in their head. Carlotta usually schedules the next drop during the meeting. When's she coming? She isn't. Sanjar has declared a stop sale on goods to Iconoclast. I don't think I should say that. I've got bad news. Sanjar made it illegal to sell you to you guys. It seems like I'm feeding Sanjar uh, for Graham. Uh, I don't know what you did to piss him off, but Sanjar isn't selling to you anymore. Yeah, it's all about Sanjar. Obviously, Graham is gonna respond like, Sanjar has gotta go down. Yeah. Is that so? That is most unfortunate. This cuts off one of our only two supply lines on Monarch. Sanjar, old friend, you're about to cross a dangerous line. About to? That idiot just declared war. I... we will deal with his subversion later. For now, we must redouble our efforts to spread the truth to the colony. Let me ask you something about spe uh, spreading the truth. I would... I should talk to Sanjar about the situation. Yes? Even if we clean up the press, how will you get the magazine to Terra 2? What exactly are you going to put in these magazines? A subtle lesson here, a word about the Eternal there. 
In small ways, I hope to bend the public's mind towards seeing the truth. You just can't call your opinion the truth. That's just... That's just not right. Even if we clean up pre the press, how will you get the magazines to Terra 2? Our very resourceful sublight friends have already agreed to help. For their standard fee, of course. They'll replace periodicals around the colony with our subtly edited versions. The board's workers will learn of our truth without even realizing it. Why go through all this trouble? Right? What are you trying to accomplish? The corporations have been shackling workers' souls for centuries. Workers are glorified slaves to their companies, to their society, to their own minds. Free will has all but vanished. I believe that by freeing oneself from the corporate structure, indeed from the very rules of man, one can find their own truth. And through that, the cosmic truth that binds us all, the eternal truth. Graham, I hate to say this, but you're not qualified. You're, you may have realized, and I think basically all people realize who work for the companies that uh, they're just they just tools, and uh, you realizing this doesn't really make you special. Uh, although a lot of them, admittedly. Uh, just, just get along with it, and uh, not like you're doing that great either. So the thing is, he just tries to achieve his goals in a very deceptive way as well, and you know he just gets people killed, all for the rebellion, and uh, he's he's just doing propaganda too. He is. What the, what the companies are doing, just kind of like, same tools, different message. I don't know. <sighs> well, it's not exactly the same tools, but like, you, you can just have your own propaganda and say that I'm gonna free people. Alright, back to the mission. Certainly. What's next? The thing is, no one has to die. People just, yeah, fair enough. You can open their minds. So what's next? I just don't trust you to uh, do this big change. Your plan is not certainly, uh, not necessarily bad, but I, I, I just, I, I just cannot justify you leading it. <clears throat> I've already sent a team ahead to scout the press. One of our best. Meet them there and find out if they've been successful. You sent the Vanoys there, didn't you? Oh, for fuck's sake, Graham! We needed them in the ruins! Our people died out there! They went willing to fight for our cause. We need reinforcements. We need new recruits. The Van Noys saw the printing facility with the same importance as I. The hell's the sense in recruiting if you're just gonna get them killed? I have the utmost confidence in their abilities. Friends, we must have faith that the men and women we recruit can handle the duties for which we recruit them. It's gonna cause these people a lot to get to the point where Graham will be overthrown. Spreading the word has to be priority number one, otherwise how can this movement grow? I want more lines to sabotage him. How could have sent them after backing Zora up, right? You could have sent them after backing Zora up, right? I don't know. I need more confrontation, more subtle, or maybe like more direct, more ways to confront him. Yes, you're damn right he could have, but he's so obsessed with preaching that he's become blind to our actual problems. Look, just if the Van Noys are still alive, get them out of there. With Sanjar pressing the issue like this, I have a feeling we'll need them. I do everything I can. Retrieve Zora's team, repair the printing press. 
So for some reason Zora is uh, second in command. Uh, although I strongly believe she shouldn't be. Retrieve Zora's team. Wow, that's so far away. I can just go head this way, maybe. Do I want to continue with this? If I didn't have fast travel, I would most likely continue over this way. But with fast travel considerations, we might go to the Stellar Bay Ruins. North. And uh, go from there. Base engineer named your cannon machine. I don't rightly know. That have been. I'm not thing. sure how we're gonna overthrow. I'd ask him, but he fell in the machine once. So. Crap. Good college. Well, they're all dead. <laughs> we're pretty good at this. Yeah, we are very good at killing people. Right, as I was saying, good call it Guster's <laughs> demise or oh, crap. Guster crushes. More bandits again. No, that's got a ring to it. Rip in peace, bandits. Oh crap, robot. Kill it like this. Whoa, what happened to it? For the robot. You. The robot is dead. Wow. They're invincible and move everything. Seems like going for good armor is quite important. Assault Rifle Ultra. Pulse Hammer. Eh, maybe we'll take it. I'm not sure how we're doing with carry weight. It's okay. Not great. Not great, but okay. Wait. What's going on here? A workbench. That's it. Maybe we can also sleep. We can sleep without going back to the ship. That's kind of nice. And now we can uh, drink a little bit. Drink. Let's drink that. Uh, what can I eat? I'm a little hungry, so maybe we should eat something. Let's eat that. Let's eat two of those. Usually you need to eat more stuff. Oh crap. I need to just use something other than the pistol. It doesn't give enough DPS. Do I have... Can I list by damage rating? No, that's not what I want. I want damage per second. Can't do that. Uh, is Assault Rifle Ultra better than that? It actually deals more damage too. So Assault Rifle Ultra is decent. But I don't wanna waste a lot of ammo. Not like we have to worry too much about it. 1,400 ammo. 
Heavy ammo. Hiding behind cover. <laughs> Good luck. I believe in you. If you if you can make it, make a wrong threat. Flame thrower. I need a minigun. Where are no miniguns? I need a minigun. Give me that. I'm just gonna replace it for my. Oh, actually, do I have one? No, I don't have one. Crap. I need one. I could have bought one, but I didn't do it. Big mistake. Wait, am I going the right way? No, this is not where we're supposed to go. Iconoclast is just dead. So we have to go this way. And also I leveled up. Uh, what I was hoping to do is like we have the 124. But we can level up. And it goes to 160. And I also get access to this perk, which is just pretty good. The party gains a critical chance 20%. When companions kill enemy, all companion ability cooldowns minus 20%. Uh, that doesn't really matter. I just want the extra damage. Kill everybody! At least this is a weapon that does something. Even if it's uh, a, a bit wasteful. I'll just scrap it. Ah, oh, this is crap. Hey, it's the twins. It's the same armor. Surprised you two needed backup. Oh crap! Can I meet? Whatever. Same armor that that I really valued uh, in Edgewater, but it's not as good anymore. And melee is just total garbage. I don't get it. Is that friendly? Iconoclast, insurgent. Hey there, guys. Uh, uh, you're dressed just like everybody else. All the bandits. And almost got shot in the head. You guys gotta have, like, some way to tell... Tell each other apart from the Marauders. Look at those. Look at those fine pieces of armor. I would never shoot at my companions. They stand out. Nioka, you're a sight right now, I'll tell you what. We are up a creek. I bet. You really come this far north for a printing press? Yeah, I know, I know, but that's the mission. Don't suppose y'all are busy right now. Uh, Graham actually sent me the security press. If you guys are doing, going after the printing press, then yeah, I'm here to help. Zora sent me to look for you guys. Once I get you out safe, I'll see about the press. I'm here to secure a printing press, but that can wait. Let's get you out of here. I appreciate the sentiment, stranger. But we can't leave without patching these guys up. Acker here is bleeding out and Jensen can't see straight. Our medic has got our trauma kit, but we got separated. We ain't seen him in a couple of hours. Any idea where he went? Yeah, on account of giving him the order. He's searching the old settlement to the north of the press. Are you guys that eager to die? Got it. I'll see if I can find them. <laughs> can I just help them? Huh? Got my 
nice. I guess not. <laughs> That's not even an option worth considering, I guess. I can help him, no problem. Oh, crap, no beasts. I could do some damage. That's the last of them. Let's go for a heal. Her body. Ah, uh, Nico. I don't know. I think Ellie and the uh, Parvati makes the best team. Just, just when it comes to a uh, very good balance. They all seem to be good at using uh, all weapons. Cascadia, Dalbrook, Ember Heights, and Stellar Bay. So we can go in, find the press, uh, do both. Yeah. Not, not, not both things is leading. Oh fuck! What's going on here? The medic is there. Oh, we need some help with this. I guess we can start with the, the big shot. Is he dead? Just... Okay. Get off. Get the safe. Her body went down. Fuck me. Oh my god, when was the last save? I really hope I'm just uh, as safe crazy as I last was, as I used to be, but no. Um, we did lose some progress. Took a lot of damage. Physical damage weakness. Take more physical damage. That's not a good idea. That's a terrible idea. Yeah, I guess I'll take the Raptor Don't Hide. Actually, I have a penalty for fighting Primordials. So, that obviously plays a part. Is there a way to climb up on a roof? Because if we could do that, then suddenly these dinos would have no chance. You guys can just head we'll over there. And I will engage from as far as possible. It doesn't matter that I crit them. They just need to be engaged. They can start coming. Can you just kill him? Yeah. No running away for you. Range weapon certainly helps. Going into melee range against these, I don't know. It just, it just playing melee would be just a panel, but just it would just be a straight downside or just straight, straight, just a bad idea. If anything, the best weapon in the game is heavy, is just he heavy guns. You know, those, those deal a shit ton of damage. Oh fuck! This is alive. I was just about to jump up. Oh. Did the medic die? Trauma kit. Euthanasia kit. Long gun, level 14. Okay. 
It's uh, a little too weak now. Maybe if I came here earlier, it would have been decent. Tremor Cleaver Ultra. Maybe. Should I give it to, for example, Parvati? Still has that. This is apparently better. Okay, let's crack it open. Pickaxe, I don't care about that, but we'll pick up the rest. So, we're just gonna go back, uh, heal the people, then we go and get the printing press, and these guys are not gonna help me get it. I got it. <laughs> Nioka, you're a sight right now, I'll tell you what. We are up a creek. I bet. You really come this far north for a printing press? What? Yeah, I know. <laughs> I already I know. had this talk. No. I'm here to secure a printing press, but that can wait. Let's get you out of here. I appreciate, but our medic is good. Actually, your medic is dead. I found the trauma kit on him, though. Oh, fuck. Well, that's better than nothing. Thanks. We'll head out as soon as we're patched up. Okay, then. At least they're sensible. They're not looking to die. Actually, I ran out of... Uh, one boost. I'm not sure what kind of boost we should have. Maybe this. Might as well. It doesn't hurt. It's not the best choice, it's Pacey's choice! What are yours today? <laughs> Bolter Pistol 2.0? It's not bad. Light Assault Rifle Mark, Mark 2. Wow, Plasma Cutter Gold. That seems like a pretty good one-handed uh, weapon, even for me. So, if any companion decided to use that, or maybe, maybe even I can use that. I'm not sure on what. Right, uh... Yeah, the companions can't use melee weapons right now. That's that's probably for the best. Because the uh, heavy weapon is better anyway. Melee weapons just seem like backup weapons. She uses a hammer no matter what. Wow, not even a scratch. So the melee weapons of my companions don't matter at all. Because I told them that never to use it. And for a good reason. Now, this is kind of a tricky pick, partially because I'm Using the dumb armor. Great work. Uh, I guess we'll take that. Mm, determination. This is crap. Inspiration. This is crap. You guys are ready. I'm ready for this. I see that now. Losses. 
left. Don't mess with us. Okay. Why so many? Ah, I pick up their meat. It's trash. I don't want it. It's gonna be hard to find it as well. Can I just eat it? Let's use it. That's trash armor. So I was here. Pick up Chronofield Aggregator. Sure. It just seems like a special item, but just an item I'm not super familiar with. Oh my god. E declares his official resignation. Uh, yeah, we're not reading that. Waterproof weaponry. That's kind of crap. Yeah, I'm not super into any of these. I can definitely skip it. What else we got? <sighs> yeah, no. I suspect the game partially has vending machines so you can play like a lunatic and kill everybody. Um, tech skills, maybe? Stealth skills, that's the one. Makes it easier to pick. You make it look so easy. Reno. Yeah, shipment status, placement orders, whatever. I'm not too interested in it. Why the hell the reptilians were living here? I guess this is shelter. Why not? It's kind of trash. Okay, seems like I need to go to the second floor. I'm not quite done yet. Oh crap. Sort of shotgun too. Yeah, I kind of have seen that before, and we're not planning on using it at all. 500 DPS is just not good enough. Also, the effective range is just pathetic. Maybe I should get more invested into heavy guns. That might make sense. Because heavy guns actually deal damage. Terry's birthday. You're leaving. Alright. Pick it. Preconditioned exo helmet is kind of trash. Oh, install the rollers. Uh, run diagnostic first. Faulty rollers. Consult your nearest printing engineer. Okay, now operational. Here's the ladder. And... Now we're ready to go, right? 
Return to Graham. We are helping Graham quite a bit. But that's not our goal. At least not my goal. My goal is to overthrow, possibly kill Graham. While gaining the trust of his crew. And we can come back here. Which, which can save time. Again, quick saving and fast traveling just saves time. If I couldn't do that... Actually, we can go past the river. But we would have to do a, a big... Um, well, at least running around. <laughs> Maybe I would have more fun on hard. No, no, no. I, I do enjoy some of the... Super Nova changes. All I'm saying is it ain't but I think hard might be a, a like better experience. No, uh, I, yeah, if you're not gonna mod the game, I would definitely uh, recommend hard. I think that would be more fun. A Super Nova is just extra, but uh, in an awkward way. Also, the a lot of the skills, like even right now, it does they don't work. Like for example, companions don't go down. Which basically what, what it means right now is that, as long as I'm not willing to accept it, that if I die, the game is over, obviously. You have to reload. But if I'm not willing to accept any of companion deaths, then I need to be so much more, uh, so uh, a, lot, a lot better leader in combat. And if any companions die, the game is over. Kind of, kind of game is over. So I, I can't just like, you know... Like, uh, throw the companions in the in the way of my enemies and uh, let them go down and they just like crawl around the floor for, for like 5 seconds and they come back up and like, Hey, I got heavy machine gun and full HP again and now you're dead. No, you can't do that. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, I, I think this is superior, clearly. But uh, not in every way. At least, maybe if you value your time. Uh, why am I here? Yeah, we want to go up. Not like games are about time at all, you know. If you enjoy just running around everywhere, I mean, that could be fun, you know. But usually we don't really see anything new other than maybe just uh, um, enemies again. If you'll just listen. No, no more listening. No more preaching. We are losing people left and right. We need to act. Enough, Zora. I'm not putting the torch to innocent people. Do you want to bring the board's cruisers and gunships down on us? Captain, apologies, but our situation grows dire. Our people talk of foolish endeavors. What news do you bring? So, as I see it, Zora cares about people. And also, up... Uh, Kinda pushes violence, and you just wanna brainwash, and you don't give a shit about people at all. If there are gunships, they sure didn't stop me from landing here. The printing press is all yours. What are you What are you arguing about? We're out of time. We need food and ammunition. We need to hit Stellar Bay while we still have the manpower to do it. Are you guys just bandits? That seems desperate. It is. We are desperate. We're starving. My people are dying left and right. You want to attack the city? Yes. I know it's drastic, but it's clear that Sanjar will never cooperate. And if it's him or us, I choose us. Wow. You're clearly not more reasonable. Are they really doing better than you are? Doubtful. But we don't need much, and Sanjar isn't going to share. I, s I see. Listen, I've been to the printing press, it's clear. Excellent. 
Did you find the Vanois? Yeah, I sent them back. Thank the Eternal. We're one step closer to bringing the truth to every man, woman, and child in Halcyon. This plan's brilliance is in its subtlety. For the time being, let us cease our activities on the tower, lest we bring premature attention upon us. I have much to do. Articles to write, sermons to ponder. We live in such an exciting time. Let's talk later. Hey, I need to see to the wounded, but drop by the clinic when you can. I want a word. I don't want to wipe out the Iconoclasts because of their lunatic leaders. Maybe that's the that's the choice. We take Huxley and get the fuck out of here. What am I supposed to do now? Um, follow up with Catherine Mallon. Meet Catherine. Yeah. Return Agnes. Need him. In Stellar, yeah, return to Agnes Neil in Stellar Bay. Yeah, we need to do that. Speak with the information broker. What I would like to do is uh, we're gonna go to town and tell them that these iconocasts are completely insane. Maybe I can talk to Huxley. Can I talk Rose into leaving? May the eternal truth guide you. I don't know about that. What are you about? Uh, anything I can do to help you out? Yeah, plenty. If you're the type to fix a thing or two, I've got a couple <laughs> reports I need to follow up on. I already did all of them. The pipes up on Milton's house burst. Someone needs to shut them off. Then there are the cables outside the bar. A sprat chewed through them, and now they're spitting lightning. Then there's the old guardhouse, outside town on the way to the old Bayside Terrace. Someone needs to reset the comms breaker there. How are they taking care of it? I'll be damned. Thanks for doing that. Here. Zora sets aside a bit or two for people who help out. Before you ask, no. It ain't pay. Just being generous to folks who do a good turn. Kinda sounds like pay to me. Hey. Thanks again for helping out. What can I do you for? Uh, show me what you got. Do these guys have anything? No, that's trash. Yes, trash. They like me though. They like me a lot. That's why I need to overthrow them. Right now. But they love me a lot. But that's not good enough. This is the perfect position to overthrow them. Huxley, are you ready to leave? Oh, hello. Good to see you again. See you around. I guess you're gonna die with us. Ah, uh, fuck. I think we gotta go back to town. Region, uh, let's zap back to town. No, we don't go to the unreliable. We're gonna go to Stellar Bay. And uh, we gotta talk to the old woman. That's one thing that we should just get out of the way. Uh, it's gonna be handy. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at his clothes. He's been domesticated again. You did it! My little boy is back safe and sound! Tell the captain how grateful we are, Tuck Tuck. Tuck Tuck. Mama, I told you that I'm not staying. I just came back to talk to you about why I left. Then I'm going back to Amber Heights. Oh, we'll get that silliness sorted <laughs> out. You're safe here with me, and that's how it's going to stay. Isn't that right? Tucker, you need to take care of your mama. You need to work this out between you. Your son is a grown man. It's time you started treating him like one. You two need to work this out between you two. There's nothing to work out. My baby's back home and that's all there is to say on the matter. 
No, Mama, I have plenty to say about this, but that's between us. Now, you promised the captain a reward, so settle up. Then you and me can have a long talk. <laughs> Here, kind stranger. This is every bit I've scrimped and scraped for years to save. But it's more than worth it to have my Tuk Tuk home safe again. Good luck to you both. Well, I'm not getting you involved with that. <clears throat> so the ship talks? Do all ships do that? I can't say for certain, since I only ever been on this one. I hate something. So... What I want to do... Search for clues... Uh, it's space-based. So... Despite... This uh, being a Monarch quest... It shows up under space. Which is a little weird. We gotta go to Scylla. As well. So, what I really want to do now... Special though, ain't she? Is uh, talk to the mayor. Yeah. What is maybe it? She, it. I, I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. Hey, Usually about your date. She was a simulated intelligence. You know, a long series of commands telling her how to react to certain inputs. You used to. What do you think now? Well, I worked with a lot of machines, and ain't none of them like her. They can be pretty smart, but mostly they're rule books with a voice box. It is different. One of life's mysteries, I suppose. I don't trust it. If it crashes us into a star, I'll be a mite upset. Alright, so, uh, Sanjar, let's talk. Thank you again for retrieving the bolt. It's every bit as complex as I'd heard, but I'm up to the challenge. Anyway, what can I do for you? Oh, man. I suspected as much. Fuck. It would have been nice to tell Sinjar about uh, the Iconoclasts uh, planning to attack the city. But I suppose he's not uh, exactly clueless about this. Because uh, he's very much against the Iconoclasts. Oh, fuck. I need to trade. Yeah. Uh, I got some stuff. You like buying stuff? Something else I can this do. This guy like, yeah. This guy walked in and bought like 30,000 uh, credits worth of weapons from him. No big deal. Uh, weight value, maybe. I can just keep selling. Everything that's merely is trash. That's trash. That's trash. It's not super impressive. That's all trash. Really uh, trash. Uh, that's kind of impressive, but I don't need to have like so many. Maybe yeah, I'm just gonna keep one extra. This is actually better than the light assault rifle Mark II. Uh, so assault rifle Ultra is just better. Uh, we can sell the sawed off shotgun. All the pistols that are seemingly uh, a little weak. I can sell that. More pistols. And this is just a special kind of shotgun. And it's trash. Okay, let's look at the armors. And we can uh, go with weight value. This is stealth skills. I'm keeping it just because of that. Tech skills, long guns. I'm not using this. Uh, not a stealth skills. Determination is trash. Defense skills. Uh, we should sell that. And I think that too. That too. This has a lot of bonuses, but not good ones. So this is trash. And 29 melee damage 5%. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. 
Uh, we should also sell junk. I guess that's it, and this leaves us at 90, which is just good enough. What else will... Okay, where are we heading? Region, over there. So damn far away! So much running would be involved. Whew, but we are almost 20. At which point, we're gonna have uh, the companions gaining an extra uh, perk, and I'm gaining perk and skills, so this is gonna be great. Anyway guys, this is a good time to take a break, so thanks for watching, and see you next time.